Hey all, welcome to Share Trek. This is Raj here, and today I'm going to talk about a therapy called as TMB355, which is the first humanized monoclonal antibody for the treatment of HIV-1 infection uh, by preventing cell-to-cell -cell fusion between the HIV cell and the CD4 T cells. It goes by the brand name of Trocarzo, and uh, it's available in um, the big countries, US, uh, Europe, and a few other countries. Uh, it's not widely available everywhere, but um, yeah, it's also a little bit expensive. I'll talk about all those things later on in this video. But before I proceed further, I'd like to request that you consider subscribing to the channel to help the channel grow. Subscription is absolutely free and you can do it easily. However, if you wanted to help the channel, we also have a Patreon account where you get early access to our videos and interesting perks please consider joining our Patreon if you can. That will help us keep the lights on and focus on bringing HIV-related information to the community. That said, let's get started. Welcome back, friends. GP120 is a glycoprotein on the surface of the human immunodeficiency virus or HIV virus. And the function of GP120 is to help it to bind to the CD4 receptor on the surface of CD4 plus T cells. Macrophages and other immune cells binding of uh, GP120 to CD4 is the first step in the process of HIV entry into host cells. So GP120 and another glycoprotein called as GP41 together form what is called as the trimer. And the trimer is what uh, lodges onto the CD4 tree cell and one of them has the function of fusing the cell walls, cell membranes between the CD4 T cell and the HIV and allowing for uh, HIV payload to get into the CD4 T cell and that's how infection takes place. When GP120 binds to CD4, it induces a conformational uh, change in GP120 that allows it to interact with the co-receptor, usually either CXCR4 or CCR5 on the host cell surface. We already uh, know about the famous CCR5 and that's how at least five people got cured of HIV after getting a bone marrow transplant with the CCR5 mutation in it. So CCR5 is something that uh, prevents the entry of uh, HIV strain 1 into the uh, human CD4 T cells and thus protects the uh, individual from HIV infection uh, or propagation of HIV further. And CCR5 is also one of the core target for AGT103-T. Uh, so we know about CCR5. What we did not know was CXCR4, which is the first time we are talking about it in this channel. So uh, what, what this, uh, uh, this particular therapy does is that it interferes uh, in the CXCR4 and uh, uh, prevents the GP120 from initiating the fusion uh, uh, reaction. The interaction triggers further conformational changes to GP120 and the associated GP41 protein leading to the fusion of the viral and cellular membranes and entry of the virus into host cell. And the function of um, uh, TMB355 is to interrupt this process of fusion of cellular membranes. GP120 is part of a larger protein complex on the surface of the human immunodeficiency virus called the viral spike ENV, which contain, consists of three GP120 molecules and three GP41 molecules arranged in a trimeric structure. So you can think of them like a pollen in the middle of a flower. The trimeric structure of the viral spike allows for multiple interaction with CD4 and co-receptor. So you can imagine them like uh, uh, pollen inside the flower. So there is multiple uh, opportunities, multiple surfaces available. And this helps the HIV to have a lot of chances to latch on to the CD4 uh, and um, work on entering into the CD4 T cell. It also unfortunately makes the viral spike a target for antibodies and other immune system components that can potentially neutralize or eliminate the virus. Uh, Trograzo or TMB355 is a humanized monoclonal antibody developed to treat HIV-1 infection. Remember, this is for HIV strain 1. It is the first of its kind and works by blocking viral entry through binding to the second extracellular domain of the CD4 receptor. This binding interfaces with post-attachment uh, steps required for entry of uh, HIV-1 virus particles into host cells, ultimately preventing the transmission that occurs via cell-to-cell -cell fusion. Unlike other antiretroviral agents, uh, 
TMP355 preserves normal immunological function while preventing HIV from infecting CD4 plus immune cells. Administered intravenously, it was launched in the US under the trade name Trogarzo in 2018. Its unique mechanism of action and ability to uh, preserve immune function make it a promising treatment for option for HIV-1 infected individuals. TMB355 works by binding to a different part of the CD4 receptor than the GP120, which uh, uh, prevents the virus, and this prevents the virus from entering the host cell and subsequently infecting the CD4 plus T cell. Uh, TIMED is the company that makes TMB355. And here's a history of the 15-year-long journey that TMB555 had to go through in order to become an approved therapy. As you can see here on the screen, in 2003, uh, completion of a phase 1A clinical trial for IV infusion dosage form was done. In 2003, fast-track status was granted by US FDA. And also in 2003, completion of a phase 1B clinical trial for IV infusion dosage uh, was done. And in 2006, completion of a phase 2A clinical trial for IV infusion dosage was done. And then in 2011, completion of a phase 2B clinical trial for IV infusion dosage form. And in 2014, orphan drug uh, designation was granted for HIV MDR patients by US FDA. And friends, if you had forgotten, MDR means multiple drug resistant. So these are patients who have been through different uh, antiretroviral therapies and uh, those therapies had stopped responding for them. Then in 2015, breakthrough therapy designation was granted to uh, TMB355 for IV infusion dosage uh, for, from an HIV MDR patient by US uh, FDA. And uh, 2016, initiation of rolling BLA submission for IV infusion dosage to uh, the patients. And this was also granted by US FDA. And in 2016, completion of a phase three clinical trial for IV infusion uh, dosage was completed. And uh, then the next year in 2017, the completion of a BLA was uh, done and pre-approval inspection for IV uh, infusion dosage was also uh, done by US FDA. And finally, in 2018, the complete approval was given, US market approval was given, and the brand name Trogarzo was uh, adopted. Since its approval, Trogazo has become an important treatment option for HIV-infected patients who have exhausted other treatment options. I think it costs around 9000 per month per patient in the US. This medicine is approved in Canada, EU, China, and Australia. I do not know if uh, this is an exhaustive list of availability. Uh, viewers can update in the comment section so that other people might know about it, uh, like if it's available in your country and uh, what is the price and so on. Uh, it will be general knowledge for the entire community. And um, I think that if you recollect our uh, uh, UB421 uh, yesterday, it was, uh, it was latching on to uh, CDR2 of the CD4 T cell and preventing, uh, uh, preventing HIV uh, trimer from uh, latching on to uh, the CD4 T cell. So this is also something in the same lines. And uh, it's nice that there are so many different approaches. And I always like the approach uh, that targets uh, CD4 T cell and tries to protect it because CD4 T cell does not mutate. And it's a much more stable target. And uh, blocking all the entry point for CD4 T cell, in my opinion, is the best approach to combat HIV because HIV can mutate all it wants, but if it can't get into CD4 T cell, then I think the patient is safe. Uh, they won't uh, progress into AIDS. So my friends, that's all for today. I hope you liked this video. This is not the end of uh, my video on this topic. Uh, uh, every topic uh, that we cover in this um, you know, channel, every therapy that we cover in this channel, I will revisit from time to time when new developments come in, especially for therapies that are in the pipeline uh, undergoing clinical uh, trials. I'll definitely come back and give more information. And um, uh, I'm also working on a few more therapies that I want to bring to you. Uh, and um, I'm also working on uh, a bunch of um, motivational videos because I think apart from uh, therapy uh, in terms of um, ART and functional cures, uh, there is a need for um, uh, some kind of psychological uh, support. And uh, I'm working on that. I'm not a qualified psychologist, but um, having started this channel as a pure uh, genomic investment channel where I was purely looking at it from a money angle, I've come a long way in the last uh, year and a half, having seen 
the thousands of people who come into our channel looking for uh, HIV cure and HIV information, um, I find that you know, uh, there are many people uh, who are struggling. Uh, they are struggling for information that's not available in their language. They are struggling because the information that is available is very scientific and they need someone to translate that and uh, make it simple to understand. They also need to talk to somebody, but there is a stigma. And um, people are lonely when they are suffering through this disease. So I'm working on a bunch of um, uh, videos where I want to motivate everyone to stay strong because if you look at it very clinically, taking ART should be sufficient uh, and it'll tide you on until a full cure is found and one can live a normal life overall and focus on other things like career, um, traveling the world and doing things like that wherever it's possible. Uh, when I say traveling the world, I mean in your country you can go all over the place and um, a lot of things are there in life that can be enjoyed. But the singular focus on HIV is very destructive because then it robs you of your life. You, you're you alive because of the ART and you should enjoy life and... Um, uh, that's that's the topic that I want to tackle increasingly as we go further in this channel. So please be patient because whatever I come with, I want it to be. Um, I want those videos that I come out with to be powerful, uh, to be motivational, and uh, to provide a lot of uh, enthusiasm to everyone who uh, sees it and listens it listens to it. So that's the plan for going forward. So please stay tuned. And if you're not yet subscribed, please subscribe and uh, help us grow this channel. And if you can, uh, you would be keeping the lights on on this channel by becoming a Patreon. We already have three Patreons, uh, but since then we haven't had anyone else join the Patreon uh, system. And Patreon helps you to finance this channel. There is a lot of uh, early uh, access videos uh, on HIV and there's a lot of incentives out there. So please check out our Patreon page. I put the link in the description. Your support for the channel will be much appreciated. That's all for now. I'll catch up with you again in the next video. Take care, stay safe and enjoy life most of all. Bye.